Afternoon folks, I'm Dave Canterbury with Self Reliance Outfitters and the Pathfinder School. What I want to do today was I wanted to kind of walk you through this Helicon Tech H harness butt pack system called the Foxtrot. I'll put the full description of it in the title to this video, but I want to kind of walk through it with you and let you see it. I've been carrying it quite a bit lately. I've got a lot of K's underneath this thing and I love it. And I want to show you some of the features of it as we go. Stay with me. Okay, so let's talk about this Helicon Foxtrot H harness system, which is basically a butt pack with an H harness. It weighs empty 690 grams. It's about 11 by 7 by 5 dimensionally. It's made out of a canvas Cordura material. It's got two external water bottle pouches that will easily fit a 32 ounce bottle. I have a 32 ounce Pathfinder water bottle on this side and a 32 ounce Pathfinder water bottle and cup on this side. So it easily holds that. It has straps on the bottom of it where you could actually place extra gear, a bedroll or something like that, that tightens down as well. And it's got plenty of extra strap there in case you had something bulky. The front of it has a Velcro patch in their Bushcraft line symbol with an external pocket that's also Velcro. The external pocket gives you a small organizer area. I've got a flashlight, a measuring tape, a few pens in there. It's also plenty big to put a small notebook in or note card pouch in. So it's a very good pouch to put your stuff in that you want to get to very quickly or on the fly while you're on the trail. Got a carrying handle on top, a shot cord on top to put an extra piece of gear, like a raincoat or a poncho or something like that. It has some Molly attachment here on the waist belt itself, right at the hip area. I have a multi-tool on one side. On the other side, I have my compass. It has connections for the H harness in two places. The H harness connects to the top of the pack here and to the edge of the waist strap here at the hip area. And then it has a nice wide waist strap on it with a good solid buckle system with plenty of adjustment around your waist. Let's talk about this H harness system really quickly. Um, I like this H harness system because it is fully adjustable. On the back side of this, it has a Velcro tab so that you can adjust this thing for length depending on how long or short your body is so it is comfortable for you. On the front side of it, it has adjustments up and down here so that you can pull it tight once you get it on as well. It does have a sternum strap here. Standard sternum strap with a little bit of a shock there so it stretches out a little bit and it is also adjustable up and down in two different areas of molly attachment there. It also has a clip on the top of the harness or a D-ring on the top of the harness here at the shoulder area where I've got a pair of gloves, a set of pacing beads and a whistle. So that H harness system is very, very comfortable and takes all the weight really of that butt pack and places a little bit of it on your hips here and the rest of it on your shoulders, which I really like. And let's look at the inside of the butt pack itself. All right, so I've taken my water bottles out here so we can see this really well. It's got double zippers on the top here. In the very top of this pouch, it has a zippered netted compartment that you can put small stuff you have to get to really quick and on the fly. I've got my lighter in there. I've got my Exotac rip spool for repair, a spare pocket compass, I've got my Exotac match case in there, some extra paracord, and of course my trusty Bic lighter. Those are all right there where I can get a hold of them if I need to quickly. Then on the inside, I've got my Shemog, I've got a pair of binos, and I've got a quick shelter system in a few stakes, a hasty ridge line. I've got a cup lid for cooking, a small roll of extra cordage, and then a helicon poncho, and there's plenty of room in there 
to put more than that in there if I wanted to. It also has a zippered pouch on the inside here that you can put stuff if you choose to. I don't have anything in that. And then a Velcro panel here on the back side as well if you wanted to put a pouch or something like that on there that you wanted to put in there as well. So it's got plenty of room inside of it and plenty of capacity. Like I said, I'm not trying to overload this thing. I like to leave some room for things that I may want to throw in there on the trail or something like that. But I've got the things in here that I use quite frequently when I am on the trail, whether that's to carry something or to set up a quick shade, or if it's just to grab my poncho out of there in a hurry if I need to in inclement weather. But again, there's plenty of room left inside this thing because I've got it cinched down. And then the way this thing's set up for your bottle and cup is it has a nesting sleeve and that also has a shock cord that goes over the top of your lid like that that has an adjustment on that as well. And like I said, there's one of those on both sides, which gives you the ability to carry plenty of water with you if you need to on the trail. So all in all, I'm really fond of the system. I've got a lot of miles on this H harness system now, probably at least 50, probably more like 70K with this system in place. I've used it quite a bit. I like it really, really well. It carries everything I need for a quick day scout or something like that, and probably could be adapted easy enough to an overnight, especially in weather like this, where you could just stuff a hammock in there and a tarp and be done with it and have, you know, something that you could cook on as well for a one meal situation. So the retail price of this thing is right around $67 US. It's like 59 euros. So I think it's priced at a good price point that it's affordable for most people for a good solid piece of gear. Okay guys, well I'm Dave Canterbury with Self Reliance Outfitters in the Pathfinder School. I appreciate you joining me for this quick review of the Foxtrot H Harness Butt Pack from Helicon. We will have some Helicon gear on our website as of I think Monday of this coming week. We have two different colors of the poncho coming in. We have the Swagman Roll coming in and we have the Bushcraft Essentials bag coming in that fits our canteen and cup set. We do not have this butt pack coming in on the first shipment, but we will have it coming in probably on the following shipment. I appreciate your views. I appreciate your support. I thank you for everything you do for our school, for our family, for our business, for all of our sponsors, instructors, affiliates, and friends. And I'll be back with another video as soon as I can. Thanks, guys.